Good morning, guys. Uh, today I have a standby shift at LaGuardia Airport. So I'm currently just packing my bags to the car. My brother's gonna go ahead and take me. And let's go ahead and start this day. So for those who are new to my channel, um, standby is about six hours. Just packing my bag. Uh, standby is about six hours and basically shows up late like last last minute or calls out last minute then i go ahead and get replaced and get used on the flight so right now it's 7 40 a.m i have to be by the airport by 8 30 a.m so i have some time i did not have time to make breakfast this morning so hey glass of orange juice will do so i feel bad that i had to wake my brother up for you know to take me to work so i told him that i'll drive there and he will drive back. Before we go any farther, I do want to let you guys know that today my video is sponsored by Fruity Pots. Fruity Pot is a wireless earphone company that I'm truly obsessed with and I can't wait to show you guys and review it at the job. All right guys, so I just got to the airport. I'm gonna go ahead and check in for my standby. Uh, let me go ahead and show you guys that real quick. And I am signed in. And I usually always take a screenshot just in case. But there you go. All right, guys, now that I'm signed in, I'm gonna go ahead and put my mask on. Hey, guys, so I am back. Um, Let's wait. Face coverings are required in the terminal, and please practice social distancing. Period. Alright guys, so I actually just went to the crew lounge, and now I'm back at the cafeteria. Just to get some food too, because I'm actually hungry. When I got to the crew room, people were sleeping, and I didn't want to vlog and wake anybody up. So I was like, let me just come upstairs. Just in case I never mentioned this, the Guardia was actually, is still actually going through some construction. So they renovated our crew room, and it's now actually pretty smaller, so. Maybe I could put my, my, my mask down so nobody's around. If you guys are new to my channel, standby for flight attendants, particularly my airline. Um, how it works is we're the last people to get used on a flight. Usually there's line holders that have a set schedule. Then there's reserves, which is me. If you are on reserve, which I am this month, you either get a wrap or a standby. If you get a wrap, that means you have to wait 12 hours from home so they can call you um, three hours or two hours before your flight and they tell you, hey, there's your flight basically go to the airport if you get a standby shift you only have to come to the airport for six hours and again you you are used last minute so if a, if a flight attendant is running late they'll probably ask you to go ahead and board a flight and just basically help and board the flight until the flight attendant gets there or if a flight attendant is running late and they miss their entire flight then they'll go ahead and replace you on that flight but yeah that's how the reserve schedule works sometimes I really like being on reserves just because um, you know I like the excitement of going somewhere new and then perhaps getting cold last minute but then like this month i don't like being on reserve just because i have so much going on that i prefer to have it set schedule and be a line holder. so there are a few restaurants behind me i plan on probably getting maybe dunkin donuts over there or something but i am pretty hungry i'm gonna start looking around and then i'm gonna go ahead and review the fruity pots that i've been talking to you guys about and yeah i'll see you guys soon all right guys so i got okay. so usually when i get a wrap i usually meal prep but since i got standby um, and last night I was doing a few like content for TikTok and etc. I just did a meal prep. So since I'm eating, I can take my mask off. Wow, I love Dunkin' Coffee. All right, guys. So these are fruity pots. I'm gonna go ahead and start the review. It might be a little bit loud because of the background, but I'm gonna try my best to speak a little louder than usual. And yeah, let's start. So the Fruity Pots earphones come in six different colors. They have strawberry, blueberry, lemon, and kiwi. Also black and white. The package is very light. Um, I do like the packaging overall, but let's go ahead and open it. All right guys, so I'm gonna be reviewing the blueberry earphones. This is how it looks. Um, it's actually very small, which is great. It's very similar to other expensive brands that they have out there. Um, and that's great because obviously this is inexpensive. Let me show you guys my opening. Um, I haven't connected it to my phone yet, so I'm going to be trying that with you guys. So it says pairing. We're going to connect. 
connecting, and perfect. So that was pretty simple. Um, it just popped up right here, Fruity Pod, and now it's connected. All right guys, so now that I show you how to connect your Fruity Pods, I'm gonna go ahead and play a song and then you guys know how the quality is from one to 10. I definitely give it a nine out of 10. The quality is really good. It's not super loud, but it's also not super quiet, which is great. I don't know if I mentioned this yet, but it does have smart touch control. So once I touch this, it paused the song, touch it again, and it's playing the song. But I think if you double tap it, it skips the song. So obviously guys, I got the color blueberry because blue is my favorite color, but um, Fruity Pot also sent me a black pair so I can use for work. So just a quick fun fact about the Fruity Pots. They are water resistant, which is extremely, extremely important to me, especially because I'm as a flight attendant, I'm always getting sent somewhere where it's raining or somewhere where it's snowing, especially if I'm going to the pool. Just go ahead and bring these, excuse me. Also, Fruity Pots can last up to three hours if you're listening to music nonstop. And this is the small charger that it comes with it. So besides the six different colors that the Fruity Pots come in, the water resistance, the fact that it lasts up to three hours, it's super inexpensive, guys. I mean, these cost four times less than AirPods or any other expensive brand out there. So I definitely recommend for you guys to check out Fruity Pot. I'm gonna be putting a promo code down below in the description box, and you guys can go ahead and use that at checkout. So my friend is actually right next to me. He saw me do the entire review, and he's actually taking a look at one of them right now. But um, what are your thoughts on it? Hey guys, what's up? So, um, I'm just checking this out right now. My initial thoughts are that it's cute because it's black because mine are white, the ones that I have, and mm -hmm. they kind of get lost all the time. So having a darker, fun color is cool. And it's actually pretty small, which fits anywhere. Yeah, it's small, it could fit anywhere, like in your pocket. So again, if you guys want to check it out, don't forget the link is down below. So actually, I only have about one hour and a half left um, here on my standby shift. My friend actually started around 11.30 a.m. and I'm gonna be leaving in an hour and a half. I didn't get used so far. Um, let me just, you know, knock on wood. All right guys, so I usually do these on my mini vlogs that I have, like my flight attendant vlogs. Um, so I'm gonna do it again on this one. Why am I like this? Anyways, um, I like yeah, let's get together. <laughs> So I usually ask um, a flight attendant that I come in. Everybody, I don't want to disrespect it. Yeah. You know, West Southwest. Southwest? Yeah. Southwest. Um. The lady told me to go this way. I don't even know why. Oh, maybe that way. Sorry, guys. We just got interrupted. <laughs> So just real quick guys, this is Benny. He is one of my friends. He's also a flight attendant for the same airline hey that I work with. Um, I'm gonna put Benny's information, Instagram, everything down below. Usually, I've done this in my last couple of vlogs. I would ask a flight attendant or a friend. I will ask them three general questions about flight attendant. So Benny, you ready? Ready. All right, question number one. How long have you been flying? Uh, like one year plus um, a few months. Cause it was April and it's um, August now, so one year and one month. No, April, May, June, July. Oh, so one year and a couple months. Yeah. Benny actually has more seniority than me. So when it comes to like bidding or anything like that, he would have a better chance of getting whatever he asked for compared to me. I've never been a line holder my entire year with American. He actually has been a line holder. And can you just please let them know how easy your life is when you're a line holder compared to being on reserve? Life is so much easier when you're a line holder because you get to know your schedule for the whole month instead of for the being whole month. on edge. All right, question number two. What is the hardest part of flying uh, for I'd, you? I'd say the hardest part is um, seeing really cute guys and then never seeing them again. Okay, so <laughs> I, can, I guess I that's the hardest part. part. I guess being on reserve and then yeah. sometimes just waiting for a call and then you can't make plans all the time yeah. for the rest of the day. And just so you guys know, Benny is actually from California. Like me, I live in New York City, so like I already have a house here. Like I to can- To prevent the spread of COVID-19, face coverings are required in the terminal and please practice social distancing. Back to what I was saying, Benny is from California, so obviously for him, being on reserve, you know, it really, it really isn't like, I think he would rather get on a trip, right? And like, stay at a hotel than staying where you're at right now. Yeah, right, right now. Whereas in me, I'd rather just stay home because, I mean, I'd rather just stay home. And then, you know, obviously it's, it's just so much stay easier. home, eat, work out, hang out with friends and family. Thank you. All right, the last question, question number three. I like to do this question a lot just because 
I know there's so many um, inspiring flight attendants out there, but the question number three is, what is the number one tip you would get for someone that's going into flight attendant training? Oh, I have a tip. This is a really good tip. Like all Two tips. Speed is stressed out. Like, okay, yeah, be a little bit stressed out, but still have fun because, how do you say it? Do your work and everything and all that. But, but just don't still, stress out. Try not to stress yourself out too much and still have fun. I have to agree with Benny. It is very stressful, very stressful. And I used to want to release that stress by going to the gym, but I would be too stressed. Oh my god, why are you doing that? <laughs> no, I'm just being, I'm being, I'm being real here. Like I would, I would be so stressful that I would want to go to the gym. I but relieve I, my stress in other ways, but yeah, definitely. But if, you, okay. But if I went to the gym, I knew that I would be missing a ton amount of work because instead of going to the gym, I could be studying. But that's only because I was stressed out. If you have to obviously take a break, take a damn break. That's about it for right now, guys. So like I said, my standby actually ends in one hour. So I'm probably just gonna end the video here. I might record later. And if I do record later, then I'll be so add that on my channel. But if I don't, this is basically it. Um, I appreciate you guys watching and continually supporting me on YouTube and on all my social media platforms. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, like it, comment, subscribe, pop, and like it, hey, and pop. I haven't done that in a while. Let me know what you guys think down below, and if you guys want more flight attendant vlogs like these, please let me know. And again, if you guys wanna follow Benny, I'm gonna put his Instagram somewhere here, and I'll see you guys later. <laughs> hey guys, so I didn't get a trip. I'm gonna just pack everything away now because my brother is actually here to pick me up. I'm kinda glad I didn't get a trip just because I have a family party later that I could now actually attend to since I'm not going anywhere. All right, so I'm walking to the departure level. That's where my brother is at. All right guys, so my brother just picked me up. Um, I didn't get a trip. I wanted to give you guys an update because I know I ended the video um, with my friend. Again, if you guys like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Ciao.